After 1492, Native Americans are often depicted as nothing more than helpless victims swept aside amidst the march of colonialism, when in fact Native Americans were often equal partners in the expanding global economic networks of the age. Take for example the Tlingit people, who for centuries had varying levels of contact with the Asian Pacific. In pre-colonial times, there is evidence they developed a metalworking tradition based on iron salvaged from Chinese and Japanese shipwrecks, which often washed up on their shores. After the arrival of the Russians in Alaska, the already sophisticated material culture of the Tlingit was enriched with Qing Dynasty Chinese coins, which were encrusted into their ceremonial masks or sewn together into a sort of makeshift body armor. The direct Tlingit participation in a vast trade network that reached all the way into Beijing is one of the many examples of Native American influence and agency in the colonial era.